kabisa nimesikiza mabogo umbea na wameniambia kwamba umbea umetaradadi umbea umewaka moto umbea unanuka moshi umbea sasa hivi nataka tukupe ni umbea katika jopo zima jopo la wambea inasema watoke wambea toka Kenya jopo la nini jopo la shirika la wambea duniani jopo la watu ambao wanakupa kipindi kikubwa kipindi bora kipindi cha umbea nambari moja duniani nazungumzia chicha ndani ya Y254 mimi kama alivyo Adam na nifahamu kama gosip commander interview kwa umbea kimataifa mzee wa dakika lakini kila sehemu inakuwa art can real besa and I am Eve Nyaga. Welcome back to Chit Chat. We are back. Yes, and with a bang. And on Chit Chat, we give you the juiciest gossip. Movies to look out for and the newest music releases. And I'm your girl, Patricia Moriuki, and we are back like we never left. Talk to us on all our social media platforms. That is Y254 across all social media platforms. And you can reach me at Patricia Moriuki. So, guys. Hey, hey. What are you doing? What are you Eh? Right. Okay. 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 I don't know. You know, you have time to 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 have to have time to have time to Mbana tu. Patamu hapo. Mm -hmm. Kurivika tena. Kali, kizazi. So mtazamaji ya boku pale nyumbani sasa hivi. Mi nitaka nikupe na fuasi ya kipike. Na fuasi kubwa. Na fuasi ya mbwenu tuzo ya kwako. Na fuasi ya mbwenu inakupa uwezo wa kuendesha kipindi. Kupitia mitendo ya kijamini. Na fuasi gani. Na fuasi ya mbwenu nangia katika page ya Y254. Fale unachia comment kupitia comment section. Kuna picha mbwoto na. Eh, Siyezi sema three beautiful. Lakini sema two beautiful, one handsome. Eh, kita mchumbari. Bofi. Hehehe. So unachia yeah. pale comment kupitia comment section. Yeah, Watu mbeo tuzomo kiwa wapi mm -hmm. Ni story gani ambu wa mesikia mm. Ambu wangependa sisi tuigusie kiunda Ni yeah. yeah. e Katika hili listi yetu katika mm -hmm. Listi ya umbea hapa mm. Ambu tuko nayo Siyo So top to top mtaka tuwaze na story nyingi sana Ambu zime, zimeza ku samba zimeza mm. ku tech trend list eh? yeah. tunasema trending news sio na kikubwa tuko na story ya mwanadada wa hapa Kenya ni mwanadada ambaye kuna mtu alikuwa na mtusi na nikasikia uchungu sana mm. eh yeah. alikuwa anasema tu kwamba yule dada ni underground atalipo maarufu na jamaa ambaye same is not ni ni transmitted <laughs> sisi jao kukukelewa utaelewa ninasema nini mm -hmm. if you know you know if you know you know obviously so namzungumzia tanasha dona mm -hmm. ama ukipenda dona tela ama ukipenda dona ama ukipenda okech okay. Ndiyo jina laki ambalo, eh, nila mtuwa kule visiwani kuna mzumamzia. Ama mama nasibu. Eh, ama mama, mama, mama nasibu. Exactly. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Umekula nini leo? <laughs> <laughs> Ni umbea una yuwacha. So, so kuna story nyingi kusena na tanasha. Mkini ndakumi ndakuwa na gusia nyi mkisi mtuongeza, mwana mm -hmm. poa. Mm -hmm. Mkisi mtaki kuongeza, matazamaji wa tuongeza. Mwana juu wa ready. <laughs> So Tanasha amekuwa katika interview kadha unajua flat Tanasha kukumbuka baada ya kufanya EP ya kwake ambayo Donatella EP mm -hmm. alikuwa na ukimya mrefu sana. Mm -hmm. Na katika ukimya wake alikuwa anamtafuta katika interview za patikani. Nakumbuka pia amejaribu kumpigia simu mbili tatu alikuwa ananiambia kidogo ameshikika hapa na pale. Lakini ukiangalia mwisho wa siku ameona kwamba kimya chake labda kinampotezea mambo mengi na mwisho wa siku ameamua kuzungumza. Amezungumza nini? Kuna kitu kimoja ambacho amekizungumza katika pita pita zangu za pale mtandao ni kutafuta mbea kutana mm -hmm. na interview flani ambao alifanya na runinga ya Uganda mm. inafahamika kama NBS kule Uganda na Tanasha alifunga kitu kikubwa ambacho ni kitu muhimu sana tunafahamu mimi binafsi nilienda katika Donatella IP na jo mliona mapicha pale ilivyokuwa nateleza mm, pale kwenye red carpet <laughs> eh, eh. so mimi kufika pale mimi jua kikubwa kile nilipeleka pale ilikuwa nimemfanyia tulikuwa tumefanyia diamond the interview the, other, the night before the the EP mm. so kwa hiyo siku tunangoja tuone performance ya Simba mm -hmm. eh, ile gari ilikuwa tunangoja tufanywe live mm. ushanelewa lakini kufika pale kwenye red carpet tunakaa tunakaa Oh, Wambie kabili tupigie suti mm. Sisi tufanyi uma interview sasa Sababu mwambie kwa namsubiri simba patikani no? Simba sha So tukashenga muna damu nda kuja oh, Kumtafta simba patikani mm. Lakini kutanda Instagram mm. Haka andika vipi Oi 
mimi kwamba sitapatikana nimerudi nime home Tanzania mm. sababu ya sababu mm. za kifamilia. Yeah. Ushaelewa? Tukadhani ni ukweli lakini mshua siku miezi kadhaa baadaye mm. Tanasha amefunguka. Amesema ameweka wazi kabisa mm. kitu ambacho tu wengi wajui. Mm. Tanasha amesemaje? Mnajua amesema nini? Mm. Amesema kwamba Damon kama alikuwa anataka alipwe. Mhm. Damon alikuwa anataka wow, alipwe. Well, okay, okay. Eh alikuwa anataka apokee mtoto fulani. Na Tanasha alifunguka akaongeza zaidi akasema kwamba wow walitumia hela kupitia connection zao ambazo uko nazo na management yake timu ya Tanasha kusikisha kwa madamu ndo anapata usafiri wa kuingia sehemu ya kutolia sehemu ya kutia kitu tumboni lakini mwisho siku bana hakuna ula... na Tanasha akasema pia aligundua kwamba katika biashara kuna malavidavi hakuna mapenzi mapenzi kitu ambacho Tanasha maybe hakuwa anajua yeye alikuwa in love na Nasiba Abdul hakuwa in love na Damu Platinums ndio pale ilikuwa tatizo tumsikiza kwanza alichokisema alafu tuchangia mm-hmm. unaonaje okay. eh mwelekezo kivisa hebu tupe hiyo clip tusikie tanasha alikuwa anazungumza vipi your boy you're supposed to pay your boy I, sure, was, you I also... already I was already doing everything on my own me and my team I have a small team but an amazing hard working team we did every single thing on our own from our pockets when it came to that event so we really struggled it was a hustle to do it um we flew everyone in from our own connections and our own pockets we flew everyone in And then last minute um yeah you know how how events happen I don't know if you've ever worked in events but you know how sports Ala umemmsikia kabisa nyinyi mmemmsikia yule Donatella ama Donatanasha pale Tanasha Okech eh yeah, Tanasha okay. Dona amedona so, amedonga hebu tuambie hivyo hebu nikuulize hmm. wewe ungekuwa na hmm. a girlfriend yeah, right yeah, yeah and she's doing maybe yeah. let's just to to kuweke kwa to kuweke weni to assume me ni tanasha wewe diamond right nam, nam. mimi ningekuwa na wewe ungeni support financially ah nige kusa, nige feel kusa. obligated okay it doesn't yeah. it, you're not supposed to you, you're not supposed to feel obligated but you na fau support kidogo yeah. the fact that yendo amelipia flight yako ya kukuja kenya yeah, the least you could do is show up without yeah, asking yes, for something ame kulipia place ya kulala and you're still asking money for the performance Is there a relationship there? Who was there a relationship? Kuna rile, there? unajua kitu ambacho nyinyi mtakielewa nyinyi watoto wa kike mnasumbua sana kuelewa mambo mengi. Nani anasumbua? Sikizeni niombe sana mielewe vizuri. Mwanzo na sibu ongera sana kwa kitu kimoja alichofanya. No, that is not fair. Damu no, 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 media yake. Sikiza kwanza. Damu tukupitia media yake wa Safi Media alihakikisha kwamba EP ya Tanasha inaonekana live si Kenya tu lakini Afrika Mashariki eh no, Mshanelea, but listen, kwa kwanza aliompa alafu akumbuke Diamond before kutana na Tanasha alikuwa Diamond ushaelewa na Diamond wa kwa Diamond kuna watu ambao wanamtengeneza okay. Diamond kuna listen. watu ambao mwisho siku na Diamond kupita mahali wanaingisha rent wanaingisha sehemu ya kula wanaingisha sehemu ya kujua kwa hiyo kwa mimiingisha hiyo pesa yote at that time let me say this let me ask excuse let me say this the list that you were supposed to do mko kwa uhusiano na mtu you support each other no it's not a guarantee no you support nah, each other it's then it's if it's not a guarantee business. then you're in the wrong place no, no, you then you're in the wrong place no, no. 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 Uh-huh. acha nikwambie the only acha nikwambie ni support kama na sisi acha support kama diamond hii ndio mtaki kuelewa kuna watu wawili hapo kuna diamond platinum na kuna nasi babdul nasi babdul angetaka kitu let me tell you if it was up to me hata afadhali basi Don't do anything else. Usilete wasafi. Usilete wasafi hapa. Just be Just there. Your presence. Your presence is everything. It's so very as in acha nikuulize sasa you can. I feel in a relationship though yao sasa nimeanza ku doubt if it really it was a genuine relationship you're supposed to support each other. You can only build each other. Cuz acha nikwambie if you don't build me then wha- why should i be with you if i don't build you the other way it's, it's the other way around. So me na za sema hivi. Hapo Diamond honestly you messed up number one, this is not only your girlfriend this is your mother's child like this is your eye manze no what at least you could do or show up no he was supposed to show up but anyway yeah let's just say that apa there was only person who was in love and that is Tanasha. Yeah, Tanasha Damon was the only was one. Yeah. He was not. Diamond was not in it. And I penda mwingine, and I penda mwingine. Yeah, sorry, na joyo story. Let me tell you, mm. just to say that yeah. kweli kabisa it was only Tanasha who was in this relationship. Yeah. She has come out to say on another interview. Yeah, yeah, that 
She's doing the parenting thing alone. alone. Completely me, alone. Let me tell but you. But it's not a surprise. Let me tell you. All the other baby mamas other than... Ladies, you have to do a background check. <laughs> you really need to. Ingia online. Like, we all know this guy doesn't support other kids that he has with other baby mamas. What the, what made you think that you are special? That's the problem with women he sometimes. No, no. You have to make your statement before. Do what? Do what? Do a background no, no, check. No, no, no. The history one. Do your history. Go the... back to the history books, exactly. please. Thank you. <laughs> Go check on the history <laughs> books. No, no, no. No. <laughs> Yeah. He wants like you know what I mean like yeah. this this this, this <laughs> Tanzanian guy mm. who has been claiming to be the father of your son. Mm. Did you have a relationship with him? I have never met this person in my entire life. Let me ask you. <laughs> so somebody would wake up uh. and uh, spread such a lie that the, that the father of your son. You've never met this guy. I have never in my life met this person. As in, you know, even those as you can say we've met with a group of people, never, ever. I don't know him. I've never met him. He just thought he would seek some attention because people happen to say that my son and him have similarities because my son has big brown eyes and he has big eyes as well. So people were comparing. So he felt like, okay, I might as well ride on this wave and, and claim somebody else's son. But we're past that. I forgave him. I have no bad blood. Are you not suing? I sued. I didn't sue him yet. I sent him a demand letter. Mm -hmm. I so sent him a demand does letter. Does still talk about it? I sent him a demand letter uh, demanding that he publicly apologize. Oh, ah, remote, remote. The TV. He wants cups and glasses. Yeah. He wants like, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. he, this, 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 this he, Tanzanian guy mm. who has been claiming to be the father of your son. Mm. Did you have a relationship with him? I have never. Hey. Alafu mmoja ukiangalia interview ile tunaiangalia hapo, yani Tanasha seems uh, so relaxed yani. Ha? Ha nini? Hatoi baby daddy duties. Eh ametulia tu. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you. Kama uko poa, I remember kutumia kwa my interview. There's a time no, that no, no listen. There's a, time Zari, there's a time Zari, there's a time Zari had an interview yeah. and she was talking about support in terms of co-parenting, Damon supporting the kids and Kuna kitu alisema, akasema, yeah. the only thing I can tell Tanasha, that was, I think, when Tanasha was, like, no, not even, no, but no, kwa Tanasha, ah, kwa pendo yeah. Tanasha pata mtoto. No, alisema, alikuwa, alisema, and she was like, mama. be ready to take care mm -hmm. of your own children. Mm. So, Missy Jui Mbona, we have history books, there's something called history. <laughs> there's something <laughs> called <laughs> background <laughs> check. <laughs> Why are you going to and get involved with yeah. someone, you already know their, with, with the background, background yeah. how they behave, how with they the do certain things. I don't think for Ata Ange takes so much time doing it. Because it's all it over. Has it has a lot of time. 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 Mwanzo amekuwa amebeba mtoto mtu maarufu sana yeah. uh, umu Afrika na umu duniani. But let me Kigile, ask you something. Ame, no. Amepata umu maarufu, ametoka kuwa msani underground, amekuwa msani superstar. Mm. But if you look at it really, amekuwa mama. Let me ask you something. Let me ask you something. Uh -huh. What is more important? Umarufu Having a child who can have access to their father and have their father in their life but only in the line eh? lines. Ama tu kukua. Ah. 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 But how many times? No, how many well, times? How many, many times? Ah, yeah. no, 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 Chia comment kupitia comment section kupitia page ya Y254 pale tuambie una maoni yako ni yapi kusema hili swala la Tanasha na Diamond. Hebu achia comment sasa hivi hicho nitasome kwanza. Naona na ninaona kuzoamira unasema tu from Meru Gikondo Gizongo Market. Eh 
Yesa sawa. Kevin Longia anasema bar sombe massive keep it real. Uh, Sparking kid OJ anasema team from county zero zero chicha ilikuwa ni mingoja sana. Na Yesu ombea ke real bistupe uone. Niko na jopo zima hapa. Uone si mimi peke yangu. Watu wote wanamaliza. Mofa tu anda ke real bistupe wezana nimeweka nao kabisa. Samuel Wode mwana anasema chicha kama kawa. Sami got ni go lock tune in from Sagina massive up as county ni morale kibao kabisa. Sasa amepiga chill ayo relax top to top kabisa comment nyingi kwa wingi zaidi ehe kuna watu wanazidi kuongea na wanapita nyangao wanasema tunes keleudi diskivu wanasema voi massive show e, mwaru wa kabisa ni kama jaribu kusema muru wa kabisa e, wa kabaru jackson naro kana sema elud kim charles anasema meru tuko ndani alafu na kevin manyis amongo anasema na manga boda tuko ndani yake dennis kipkorira anasema tuning from makutano lugari show iko lit sana ehe na mimi nazungumza hapo tena nala top to top kabisa dennis e, mokora shotman anasema county number no. 34 is watching you live maina france karisha anasema kirinyaga kengeje west to watching alafu bitcoin nuti bitcoin anasema sema nyiri walk non stop kashike mbaya sana eh, crucial ya kuza anasema ndani ya county nambari moja mtaa wa Kiswazi tukalata king fox anasema niko kabete ni chezee t by sina na featuring god sasa sawa kabisa itakuwa na kama tutaka kutika renew release ni eh. tutakuwa napitia so tutakuwa kusoma comment nyingi zaidi achia comment kupitia comment section kupitia page ya 254 ile page ya pekee ama unaachia comment ndio nitakuwa naisoma moja baada nyingine au vipi mm. team zima mm. patricia mhm nasikia yep, kwamba yep. tukivuka boda eh, tupande mail tuchukue masaa kadhaa eh, tunafika <laughs> baka kuli katika hashtag number 1 sasa hivi ambayo ni trend duniani hashtag mm, yeah. ambayo sisi tumevalia nguo yake mimi na Eve hapo lakini Patricia alikataa kuingia kwenye memo kwenye kwenye yule anasababisha anasababisha black lives matter yeah black so, lives matter ya muingereza muhusi ambaye anafanyika kama George Floyd yeah. ningetaka Patricia tupeleke moja kwa moja tukusi tukie moja hivi alafu tuko tunaingia ndani zaidi okay mm -hmm. so i am sure kila mtu Nani. like 99% of people in this world know yeah. what is happening right now in the US Nani. we have Uh, protest in different uh, states in the country because of the killing of George Floyd no. and by through police brutality yeah. but now many people have come out to stand and support uh, the family of George Floyd uh, to show support for people like during the protest to basically just send a message that I'm black yes but I think I should be treated better mm. with and it's so beautiful when you see white people in the protest yeah. because now you feel it's not a fight only for the black people mm -hmm. it's a fight for the entire nation though kuna wale tu wakatiri tu wako tu mahali they wapo, don't wapo, find so there's always uh, a mad person uh, in every market yeah but mm -hmm. we've, we've still people were wondering why why are people protesting and all that but looking at the positive which is the best aside the support that people have been able to receive that is people in the streets yeah. and the family of the late uh, mm -hmm. George Floyd George we know Floyd. he has left a, a daughter mm -hmm. and um, the mother of the child so ni kusema tu like whatever that is happening right now i think we are living in an era whereby racism is not something that we're supposed to be sitting down and talking about na, na kitu ambacho na kitu ambacho kina fresh we really not supposed si, to be talking si about wazu, that si si watu wasi peke yao ambao wamejitokeza katika msanii mbele lakini kama ukiangalia picha hii ambayo yeah, yeah, we, we, yeah, we have baba kuna wazungu wenyewe yeah, watu yeah, wapi ambao that's the most beautiful thing about it na mimi nafurahi kwamba dunia inakuja katika umoja na inakuja kuangalia kwamba watu wasi sieti ni wajinga watu wasi sieti wana upungufu lakini watu wasi pia wana akili zao na wanafanya vitu vikubwa duniani the reason maybe even whites are out there naam We, like what sasa wameanza kupendana we no. are marrying black people yeah, so, we have black friends true. so i can't just say that i will sit in the house and not do something about it when i have people who are surrounding me that are black true. for example like talking about them. marriages yeah. mm -hmm. we see white people now marrying, marrying black black people, yeah. black people marrying white mm -hmm. we have bibi the sorry the husband to serena williams mm -hmm. alexis he actually resigned from the board uh, of reddit mm -hmm. na amesema kwamba he wants the board to appoint a black mm -hmm. person as the member of the board which is something very beautiful because he says he does not want time mm -hmm. to come and the daughter is going to ask what did you do for me yeah. or what did you do to make mm -hmm. sure like things are better so he was is looking for something an answer that mm -hmm. watu wengi sana they come they're coming up to be like we are living like the for example interracial marriages mm -hmm. the mother is white yes maybe the dad is black mm -hmm. the mom is black the dad is white 
of course these kids mm -hmm. are going we to be identified as, yeah. mm -hmm. as black. Mm -hmm. So people are just trying to build a better future mm -hmm. where we're not going to have certain issues. Another celebrity, I think uh, there is Cynthia Bailey, a Cocoa Real Housewives of Atlanta. Mm -hmm. She's a model. Now the fiance is her, I think he's an anchor uh, and I relate to an Amamboya Sports. They marched and talked of the importance. They took their three daughters mm -hmm. for the protest mm -hmm. to just show these kids that this is what you're supposed to be doing. Yeah. And it's the be it's in in the very best when you have to mm -hmm. teach children mm -hmm. from a very young age. Because kuna picha mingi sana zimekuwa kwa mtandao. Like white, uh, a white baby running to hug a black a black yeah, child and this yeah. is because this child has been taught that yeah. you're supposed to love on to everyone love regardless of their, of their color, color yeah. Yeah. yeah kabisa ina inakuwa time tena sana unakiangalia pia watu wamejiuliza labda familia kama judge flood ukabao kujifatisha ametuambia hapo kwamba ana ana binti mdogo wa miaka sita tu na vile vile mke wake uko naalika nilikuwa na katika interview fulani ambayo nilicheck alikuwa akizungumza na press mke wake anaweza kuzungumza mambo mengi na akili yake akisema kwamba inamsikitisha sana kwamba George atakuja kuona hata kuja kupata zile chances eh za kupeleka mtoto wake university zile graduation yeah graduation to walk the daughter down there it's so sad so ina muuma sana pia inamchukiza zaidi wakati anaona mtoto wake akija kupata ile mapenzi ya baba lakini ukiangalia kuna watu ambao na raw ambao ni raw kabisa ni zaidi watu kama mtu kama Kanye West yeah man like and ametoa hela nyingi sana 2 million dollars ukiangalia hizo tukipiga hesabu za kanisa za Kenya ni zaidi ya milioni 200 za Kenya more than 200 million na amesema kwamba itamsimamia mtoto wa George Floyd kupeleka shule aisha maisha mazuri vitu kama vile and it's there's actually a fund like going if you want to end up to the 2 million dollars you can do that na utapata ni nyingi sana ukiangalia mtu kama Kanye West ni pia um what is it recross eh recross um recross pia walikuwa out in the street so many celebrities were out in the street Challenge poet and a direct challenge. I remember maybe the top is a flan. When I would have a top is a ninja sign. Even I think when all this started, people like um, the wife to Justin Tibalik, mm -hmm. they well, it was do ya kusema no. if you're if you're arrested because of yeah, protesting, this is, bail out, this bail is two hundred thousand no. dollars. Mm -hmm. I don't going to bail out. Also, yeah, very um, many so people many have come out. Jesse amejitokeza akazungumza na na governor kabisa wa kule nini Uingereza kule hiyo sehemu. Akaanza kumwambia kwamba hilo swali ukiangalia vile vile nani mwingine amejitokeza. Justin Bieber mwenyewe amejitokeza akazungumza. So ukiangalia watu ni wengi sana. Rick Ross kama unaiona hiyo katika hiyo kanda sasa hivi kwa Yohani. Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Watu ni wengi ambao wamezungumza na tunasema kwamba in a five. Even so it is, I think even Jordan different has. actually yeah. Kenya made it to number 14 yeah. to countries that stood with the protest in, in, in the US. US. So many Bakikani countries, Bidi. many countries are also participating in Sana. this because I think yeah. you can be a Kenyan and find yourself in the US. Correct. You can be a Tanzanian and find yourself there. True, no so correct. it's a fight not only for people for like uh, the the US citizens mm, but, but I think it's something that is very global. Kabisa na ni story ambayo mimi binafsi naikubali na nasema mwisho siku kupigania haki leo. Yeah. Usipopigania leo ambao tunaishi katika you know, ikaa. And even um, before, before we finish uh -huh. this story, I think like coming back home, uh -huh. we should also fight tribalism. Kabisa. We should make sure Kabisa. like Kabisa. we live in a very free no. community where it doesn't matter where you come from. Yeah, we there, should also look also at ourselves. There are issues in yeah. our country. And you are there, you man. Yeah, you are there, you are there. You are there, you are there. You are there, you are there. Eh, na we, you are there. Yeah, you are there, you are there. You are there, you are there. A certain tribe that your mother does not approve. But such kind of issues, like we are against marrying other from other tribes. Yeah. So many issues that the people think. So you should address that. Yes before you even before get we, yeah kabisa upendo unaanza na unasema upendo unaanza na mimi na wewe mm -hmm. na mwisho siku upendo uta mimi niko na upendo wewe na upendo yeah. maisha dunia nzima ina upendo you know yeah. back okay. in the days racism ilikuwa like people are yeah. actually being sold you yeah, know yeah, it's yeah, it's so it's so sad to see that as much as ceo iko yeah, there's still another, another way yeah na yeah. kuna yeah. wasanii wengi sana ambao wameimba sana muda mrefu ukiangalia kina Notorious BIG walikuwa wanakashifu sana ukiangalia watu kama kina Tupac Shakur walikuwa wanakashifu sana vitu kama vile na mshwa siku ukiangalia leo pia watu ambao wamezaliwa kizazi cha chacha wanapigania basi tunakubali mshwa siku tunasema kwa Mwenyezi Mungu mbele sisi nyuma mshwa siku mambo yatakuwa sawa we've even had like black celebrities talk about living in a certain uh, classy uh, place mm -hmm. but because they are black they when someone sees them mm -hmm. yes you're a celebrity mm -hmm. but mtu tu akikuona just mm -hmm. because of the color of your skin they just start doubting there's a story about we're going to be talking about Gabrielle Union but mm -hmm. she has ever shared before even get to share that yeah. she, when they moved out to a different place with yeah. their kids you know they have the hubby has three mm -hmm. sons from a previous uh, marriage mm -hmm. 
there is a, a family that saw the kids just playing around mm -hmm. and called the cops. And my dude is a celebrity. So if it happens to celebrities, imagine to people with all their money in the she... world, imagine about the person down here. No, really. Na, so no, how can like you can if you if you really look at it it's a very bad thing. Kabisa na ukiangalia mimi kitu kibinafsi ambaye naamini kwamba kando na watu kuangalia kama black sawa jiwezi ukiangalia hii janza leo mm -hmm. lakini tumekuwa tukifidiwa kama inafaa tupiganie uh, watu wao wanafaa piganie haki yao. Ukiangalia mm -hmm. katika filamu nyingi hapo zimetolewa yeah. most yes. movies unaona mm -hmm. wanaisha kuhusu blacks wanavotitiwa. Yeah, unaona kama kwa mfano you not know, getting a job because you're eh, black. Kama kwa mfano inaitwaje hii ya ya America sio nini fulani wanacheza football ni Saudi na hiyo movie ni sile mm -hmm. all America ni kama kwa na America kule mm -hmm. jamaa ambaye anacheza alafu ana ndugu yake mdogo mmoja anamwambia kwamba kuna maskari mm -hmm. basi utoe mkono na uweke juu sana yeah. kwa sababu yeah. yeah. mshoa si kwa don't resist yeah. so yeah. wana wanafikiria maybe una bunduki una nini silaha yeah. ukiangalia ni nyingi sana baadhi ya wengine even yeah. like the Oscars has had issues with um, not nominating black uh, no. directors black, uh, black actors black actress, and actresses so yeah. it's something that cuts across everywhere yeah. it doesn't matter your status yeah yeah acha watu tuwape tu nafasi pia tuambie maoni yako ni yapi kuhusiana na haya mambo ya protest he he protest ambazo zinaendelea huko nchini Uingereza mwanaza kabisa hebu acha comment kupitia comment section kupitia page ya y254 pale facebook na muone na naona Elias Mashawa na anasema present anasema na kuru na led eh na net county pale na la net eh sasa Antonio Tony anasema tune from Batolimo Baringo county eh big up sana MK Morule anasema tune from Taita Taveta county the show is lit agi mke anasema kamba bay tune from Naivasha Mibera eh eh nani mna zungumza tunalala tatu tatu kabisa inakuwa time tena zaidi inakuwa moto eh eh tunasema hapa tunakupa mbaya tu ambao umetaradadi Jackson JD Brown anasema J from county number 1 naona sana bwaga zuchi moja kali eh eh toko ukiangalia katika new release usijali utapata Jose mpena maana anasema yeye tinyanyuki very lot eh hapa tunakupa mbaya ambao umetaradadi au vipi nani mna zungumza tunalala tatu tatu kabisa naona yule love child police anasema it's police Kenya tune from Nikio Nyandaro like the shit on fire really called visa the summer events watching from tika shoots later kevin shira on a summer from mosorio to nandi comes and follow the show had it a mati and sami salena summer love from kitari gatu and i'm going to go home to the summer to the cup of running a vitamin extra and head coach my own up we are sparking on a caroling get it on the summer watching from kamarin itana laughing as much as more ring remote and the summer tune from nakuru subukia and subukia laughing on a kevin guitar and summer giving guitar to the mayor of chogori and kodani and some of you live young and some are kanja Kanyanjara mwe mwena wa ndei ya kikuyu tuko ndani ya mitambo. <laughs> hey, hey, sasa so nadhani nimesoma kikikuyu hapo leo. Mm. Ndio nazungumza. Nimesoma na kikuyu. Nimesoma na kikikia hapo kabisa watu wazidi kuachia comment kupitia comment section kupitia page ya watu wa five four nitakuwa nakuja kuzisoma zingine au vipi? Tofauti tofauti kabisa eh. Yeah. Uh, we were to talk about uh, story ya Gabriel yeah. Union. Yeah. Uh, she's actually suing um, Simon Cowell. Mm -hmm. Kuna tunajua there have been issues with her like uh, suing like that is NBC Kabisa, and America's ni, Got Talent. Tu, yes. Eh, kwa faida ya mtazamaji ambaye anatazama pale nyuma najui nani Gabriel Union nani? Yeah. Hebu mguusi nani kidogo. Gabriel Union is an act she's an actress. Mm -hmm. She's married to uh, Dwayne. NBA to Dwayne She's got Dwayne, Dwayne, Dwayne Wade no. uh, is a retired basketball player. No. No. She featured as a judge no. in America's Got Talent season 14 that is uh, ilikuwa last year 2019. No. So I'm sure that is no. background no. ndio hapo no. yeah that no. that no. Gabriel no. Union. No. So amekuwa na issue sana akisema during the entire season she has had ali experience sana discrimination kadha. We know she likes keeping her hair Oh natural and yeah. all that. So there were issues with how her hair looked. Mm. They felt like it was not Good fit enough. for the show mm. because we've had many black actors Uh, many black actresses say that they have had issues with their hair where they show up on a set na unaambiwa no maybe we need the hair put softer wig, maybe softer, put on a wig or no re braids. yeah relax your hair mm -hmm. so ameza kusu she's going to be suing Simon Cowell mm -hmm. for those uh, uh, discrimination uh, factors that got to happen uh, during mm -hmm. the entire season and Bonaka ametokelezea kasema like cuz Abi has really been supporting her on this cuz the first time she talked about it some people didn't take it serious mm -hmm. so after now going to sue Simon Cole the husband is like you did nothing as the that is NBC uh, studios they did not do really anything when Gabriel uh, 
like expressed what mm -hmm. has really been yeah, happening what, yeah. and we're just hoping like with everything that is happening like these conversations are supposed to be conversations Dead. of the past yes because when you look at her she really did an amazing job mm -hmm. at the like americans got talent that is last year now like when i appear sometimes you could tell how like certain contestants were treated that based on the color Black of your skin yeah. yeah so i hope i really hope that it's going to be to be very good for her because ali lose she walked out of the job so mm -hmm. she walked out with a lot of money but i hope that for those Maybe who can't have made more if <laughs> yeah if those things didn't happen treatments. and actually i am for this is to make sure like she's fighting for those who get to come after mm -hmm. after her that they get to find a better they get to find a better place for them to to really work on without any discrimination mm -hmm. because it's how your hair looks like because it's the color of your skin and all that that is terrible yeah that is terrible kabisa ni kitu ambacho mimi binafsi akinipi raha kinanitamausha na kinanipa uzuni lakini mwisho siku wanasema kwamba na mambo mengine yatokee na sisi tujifunze ndio maana yeah. pia haki ipatikane mm -hmm. sababu utasipojitokeza pia inakuwa ngumu sana au vipi yeah. yeah, ukiangalia kwa unapendeza sana na majaji wenzake nene vitu kama hivi na kwa top to top sana na tukitoka matters international turudi hapa Kenya kidogo Uh, kila mtu anafahamu tombo alizalisha mziki wa genge Kenya. Yeah. Watu ukitaja genge utamfahamu kitu kitakuja kile ni jua kali. Jina lingine ambalo litakuja kwa pili ni nonini. No, ni, ni. No, ni. Na alianza no, amekuwa katika interview fulani inafahamika kama cleaning the air with Richard Njau. Mm -hmm. ni, 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 ni nzuri ambayo pia unaweza kufuatilia katika mtandao wa YouTube pale. So ameweza kuzungumza alivuanza historia ya genge nini vitu kama vile walivyokuwa wanaifanya katika kirumu tu mm -hmm. eh, katika sitting room ya kina Kilemo. Yeah. Pale na ameweza kuzungumza mambo mengi akaeleza alivoingia kufanya ile style ya mziki baka akakuwa controversial. Na kitu kikubwa ambacho aliweza kutoa ushauri ni kwa wasanii ambao wanatokea sasa hivi. Anasema kwamba controversies mm -hmm. hazikumpa corporate deals mm -hmm. zote. Ani zilimnyima giza corporate deals. Ndojo tuwezi kataja makampuni sababu oh, watu wanajali no, pia matangazi. Naam. What kind of controversies ndo? Ndojo tuko naona no nini mara eh. <laughs> Nimetaka kusema hivi nakumbuka kwamba nikisema hewa ni pia atakuwa kuna watu wadogo wanatazama show sasa hivi lakini tunafahamu controversies mambo mengi tu ambayo ukiangalia watu wanakuwa ushangalia angalia katika nyimbo zake kuimba zile vulgar language ukisikiza wanaimba ni sume kwa mfano nitumie kama genge to eh wanaimba wale kina ethnic nini vitu kama vile an example of what i think is doing right now unaona sawa ukiangalia zile controversies nilikuwa na mwenyewe anasema kwamba akiangalia kinaogopa wale wasanii walikuwa kinaogopa pale walikuwa wanapata deals mshanelewa kina deals kina walikuwa wanapata corporate deals lakini yeye ilikuwa vigumu sana kwake kupata na anasema kwamba corporate deal ambayo ameipata kwanza ilikuwa mwaka 2018 juzi tu which is very sad for someone Ani, who has been in life for a very long time yeah. lakini ni, ni vizuri sana kwa wasanii ambao tutazama sasa hivi wajifunze na wajue kwamba controversies muda mwingine zinakukost sana mm -hmm. pia kuna controversy ambazo zinaweza kukujenga lakini nategemea vile mm. wanasema controversy inaweza kujenga positively ama inaweza kujenga negative. Yeah. Kiangalia upande wa nini? Especially in terms of content, kitu yenye yeah. una imba. Cuz you know for, for someone to really Hebu come tum, and have your okay. Oh, yeah. Eh eh. Learn from this. Yeah. You know? So mimi nikuja ku realize baadaye. By the time Jua came out, alikuja na ile apige zile beat ingekwezi ma beat za ku dance. Mhm. Mm akuingia na hiyo noma yangu. Mhm. Hiyo noma ya controversial. Because wali learn na Clemo aliona eh controversial ni top lakini no nini kuna vitu wanafinyiwa. Kuna mavitu wapati. Mm -hmm. So akalan. Lakini hao kuniambiaga. <laughs> Sawa. Mimi nikuja ku learn baadaye by the way eh hii ma controversy kidogo nimeleta noma. Hey boss that means you are you are school because you're not getting corporate money Mabiza. even though uko na hizi ma big shows. <laughs> Let me tell I mean you. big hits. Let me tell you. kizungumza hapo. Wona feel kabisa binafsi anaizungumza jeni mnene from the heart. Na si rahisi kwa wasanii wengine ambao kuja kutoa ushauri kama ule. Yaani ile ni siri nzito sana siri kwa kutoboa. Ukiangalia mtu kama Masauti amepost mpaka hiki kipande ambacho tumekiweka. Amepost kipande kama hicho kimabeno nini? Nashukuru sana kwa kitu ambacho umekisema sababu kimenifungua macho na kimenifanya nimechukulia vitu katika angle nyingine tofauti. Unaelewa? Cuz you know for for a company to really approach you ama mtu kutaka maybe to do for you to 
be on a promotion no. or to get an endorsement they look they don't only look at your numbers mm. as a musician or no. as an actor or actress they also have to look what content do you put out, out there, there. Yeah. so i think basically as we get so much excited what you don't only look at that there are other opportunities for you to make money and if you're a wise person you're going to make sure that whatever you're producing is going to open other doors for mm -hmm. you because celebrated sana but Maybe people are gonna outgrow that. And of course, that's what I'm saying. When you come on, Sally, you can't, or maybe as a as a creative, you can't live without investments. Yeah. You can't. Do, so, so I think even Kamene back in the day, it time again get on Ilianza sana. Ali wambia support these people, show them the way. Msi wakeme sana. Wambi any. Yeah, they, they, they exactly don't know. What they don't know. Yeah. They don't know. Wambi any. If you do this, then you won't get. So if we if we do it back, yes, yes, kila mku. If we do it back, yes, yes, kila mku. If we do it back, yes, yes, kila mku. If we do it back, yes, yes, kila mku. If we do it back, yes, yes, kila mku. If we do it back, yes, yes, kila mku. If we do it back, yes, yes, kila mku. If we do it back, yes, yes, kila mku. If we do it back, yes, yes, kila mku. If we do it back, yes, yes, kila mku. If we do it back, yes, yes, kila mku. If we do it back, yes, yes, kila mku. If we do it back, yes, yes, kila mku. If we do it back, yes, yes, so and it's and I think it does not only cut uh, in music, it cuts no, across no. everything. That is like even you, you are even creative. yeah, even if you're not like in the me, in the media music or in the limelight, no. whatever that you get to do and to portray, especially for us, you know, like if it's on social media, whatever you get to put on those pages is going to determine maybe one day you might be like an opportunity might come, mm -hmm. but you only get to miss it because of one thing that you put on, up on Twitter. Let's not forget, the internet never, never forgets. forgets. Yeah, never forget. yeah. So, let's speak careful. Let's be careful. I know. We need to do it. We need to do it. And we see social media handles. Yeah. We see that we make a video about the drama. We make a video about the drama. And that is how um so everyone knows what he and no. then after by the way when we go through our comments me don't know what he you do, what do you mean to live on the other to catch up okay all right i know what he by billboard the the most watched homegrown artist no. number one most watched home, homegrown no. artist na meza kutoa album juzi juzi inaitwa um inafahamika kama just, um, just in love yeah, just in love no. yes just in love and we have the first track before doing that, first track, eh? That is your list of boys that you na na billboard, eh? The list of boys that you are going to follow. The list of boys that you are going to follow. You know, the brand is going to get a view of twenty-seven million, eh? The young man, young man, come on, boy, you change gear. You go make a little bit of gold, amoy. You know, you need to get a view of views. So, you know, you are going to change gear. Views are going to get a lot. The last boy that you are going to get a lot of people are going to get a lot. The last boy that you are going to get a lot of the only gangeton group. Okay. Bundocks. Gang ya kujepa na milioni kumi na sita la fu OG is OG hip hop is all represented kali kwa faka kuwa palo shanda leo nyashinski akwapi nyashinski ya tokea mna juu nyashinsi tu na na mpenzi lakini sijumbo na mtazamo video zaki manu ba na producer hatu ni shabiki kubwa zaki eh by the way what's wrong with nyashinski mola tu ni kusa mwoni goma so kiangalia sasa hivi pia Tanzania pia list ilitolewa na ukiangalia pale pia Diamond alikuwa hapo ndani anaongoza na vile vile Harmonizer kukosa kwenye list ni lazima ngemtaja na ukiangalia pia Uganda ikatolewa na Afrika nzima ikatolewa Afrika nzima sasa unapata pale wa Kenya tu kubahatika kuwa ndani lakini Mtanzania alikuwa hapo pale Damo Platinum sio so imekuwa ni list ambayo inaleta raha sana lakini kikubwa ambacho tunafurahi ni kwamba Otile Brown amepata raha nyingi zaidi ukiangalia juzi Otile Brown alianza kujizawadia gari ya BMW Shendelewa. Na badia kujizawadia gari, kusama likuwa ni jizawadia gari, kwa sababu yee, anatoa album yake Just in Love. Shendelewa. Sasa hivu tina wakapewa zawadi nyingini international gift na billboard kwa mbeni na mbali moja. Shendelewa. So kwa kiko Otile Brown yamekua ni celebration time. Like honestly, ya kutile ya mewak. As in kama kuna mtu mwenye ya mewak. Na. No, no, natu kazi yake, like hard work pays. Otile has worked. Kwa katika yu album ya Otile, mnapenda ngoma gani. 
Um, what I should say more I no. haven't listened to all of them. Yenye ni meskiza sana ni hit and run. I think ni meyona in so many, so many TV stations on the play. Kabisa, mii kuna yambayo na ipenda sana mbayo, ame mdisi damu platforms pali, yukuna kama washana na pombe. Ama mifanya na major, eh, okonko, tuto adija. Sasa, tine brown pali endani, unamsikia na sema gomba, anataja tanasha pali endani. Alafu, anasema, yes, it's Simba. Simba wenye ni mlanyasi. Anajaribu kumshia damu. Anasema kama damu si mlanyama, mademu wake wako chini, mademu wake wako down. Really? Ana mbis damu. Really? Kwa sababu anasema ni mlanyasi. Eh, Simba mlanyasi. Yaani mademu wake wako down. Unaelewa? Yaani huo chini. Eh, wake ndo wako juu. Unaelewa? Yaani huo. Akina vera na na bayet. Eh. Wake ndo wako juu. Wake ndo wako juu. Unaelewa? So mwisho siku, lakini katika ngoma ambayo wametoa, pia yeye itandran sasa mpya. Ana pia analia pale ndani au telegram. Anasema kwamba wale ndio mambo yakakuwa naye yeye aka invest nini mavitu kama vile lakini mwisho wa siku Neymar ka mzuga yeye akamwacha msikia sasa utelepro pia analia licha ya mwisho wa siku kusema kwamba yeye ndo ndo simba la nyama lakini mwisho wa siku pile nyama mwisho wa siku anaweza kala nyasi nimepata simba mwingine sio hakiki kikubwa kwamba niongea sana utelepro ni step four ambayo amechukua kwa album unajua si si step rice Yaani album ambayo ina ngoma nzuri nzuri ameshirikisha wasanii wote wa Afrika Mashariki eh. Amepiga na Medi pale ndani, mm -hmm. amepiga na Juma Jokes pale ndani, mm -hmm. ukiangalia so ukiangalia amekutanisha na amepiga na Kidum pale ndani. Mm -hmm. So unaona kuna Rwanda, kuna Burundi, kuna Tanzania. Iko poa. Kila mahali ya is uniting okay. is perfect. So utaangalia ngoma yake mpe ambayo ametoa, inafahamika kama hit and run, alafu usi hit remote and run stay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.